next on turf. The market leader, Al Dassam. Odds on here for George Bowie. Not a bad beginning. Good time girl, very eager. She goes off to the early lead. She cleared away by a length and a half. Sharp Army in the maroon colours is second. Old Kasner is third. Fast Uno sticks to his stations. Towards the extreme outside, white sleeves and red cap. Nurbano currently in no man's land. Then comes Nafas. Old Dassam sits just behind midfield in the green sleeves and cap. That's in and amongst horses. Principal for company. And then comes Padika. Is the field covered by about six lengths as they head down towards the final 700 metres. Good Time Girl is the one in front. She shows the way by a length and a half. Al Hasner's in the all blue colours. Noah Bono. Al Dassam's in the green sleeves and cap tracks the leader. Gets a nice wind break with Sharp Army two off the inside. Fastuno nearest us. Padika. They got about four lengths to make up, but they go to the final 300 metres and Al Dassam asked to run and run he does. Good Time Girl is second. Padika's third. Then comes Al Hasner who's further back with Noah Bono, but Al Dassam is showing his quality here. 100 metres has left to run an equally impressive win and he's not come out of cruise control Al Dassam the winner, 1-2 for George Bowie as Padika ran second third is close, Nurbano involved with good time girl, then came Sharp Army Fast Uno, Al Kasner further back to Princeville and the fuss Al Dassam equally as good equally as natural as it was about a month ago. Padika ran second, third is very tight, good time girl Nurbano. It's a photo. Then came Sharp Army, Al Hasnet, Fast Uno, Principal in the first. Impressive once again from Al Dassam, who, like his first start at Maidan this season, travelled easily under Mikel Barcelona. And when asked for an effort, he dropped his shoulder and quickened up nicely. And he's beaten his stable companion, Padika, who's run on really well against the near side rail. And Al Dassam is just a class apart from his rivals. And he's come home comfortably in front once again. The strength of the form is something that we will only find out in time, but hopefully it would lead us to believing or leading us to understanding that uh, what we are seeing, we believe that we are witnessing a very smart sprinting three-year-old. Al Dasim, the winner from Padika. Norbana, who was third behind Al Dasim when Al Dasim won last time, was third again. Good time gal, the grey, has uh, run better on this occasion in fourth. Not a bad effort from Sharp Army uh, in fifth. Um, but Al Dassam, miles better than his rivals. The son of Harry Angel has been on a winning roll for George Bowie, and he has come home comfortably in front. Wonder what the plans will be? Well, we can always ask George Bowie and connections a little bit later on. Uh, but Mikel Barcelona had the pleasure of winning once again at the carnival on Al Dassam. So Al Dasim, who provided George Bowie with his first winner in Dubai when winning what, four weeks ago, has led home a 1-2 for the stable on this occasion. So a really big payday uh, for the yard. The best part of 60-odd thousand pounds just jumped in with the first two there. Uh, Nor Bano in third place, as Sally mentioned he was when third behind Al Dasim in that race a month ago. And he's got... Definitely credentials of being able to win a race. It was a, a 